afternoon everybody uh, Josh here we're standing here at uh, the gravesite of the iconic and legendary James Douglas Morrison and our love becomes a funeral pyre I remember about Jim Morrison is watching him as a kid and loving his music because it was it was very deep. We just finished the tour, a 13-day tour, starting from Toulouse. Toulouse up to Normandy, Giverny, and then four days in Paris, and then 11 and a half hours on the plane back, back to, Los to Los Angeles. AKA Jim Morrison of The Doors. I don't need to go into his accolades or what he's known for accomplishing. I'm pretty sure everybody in the world knows. But uh, this is our last stop in Paris. We're getting ready to move on to Geneva and Florence and Rome. But we just wanted to take a moment to come here and give you, our viewers, our fans, an opportunity to, to see this. I remember watching uh, The Doors, you know, the movie with Val Kilmer. Um, and I remember at the end, when they, after he died in the movie, they, they brought us here. But, you know, if my memory is correct, it, it, it was different in the movie because they, all the walls surrounding his, his grave uh, were all graffitied, you know, people writing their messages of love and respect. And admiration yeah not not the case here there's you know there's some scratches people probably with knives and stuff putting their initials in and stuff like that but as you can see they have it gated off um, you know some people have put their locks of love here on the gates which is a humongous tradition and symbolism in Paris for uh, two significant others sharing a, a moment of love but uh, yeah, it's not as glamorous as is portrayed in the movie, but again, we figured we were here, and such an iconic rock figure. Uh, I'm a huge fan myself, so again, you know, we're, we love the glitz and the glamour of life, but sometimes it's, it's, it's quite nice to sit back and you know, appreciate something and uh, to give you respect. So there it is. And uh, this is what it looks like in real life. 